there, Jackie St. Cyr. I'm here with Danny Sandworm of MDS Farms. We went to different schools together and now we're reunited. I have a couple questions for him. So tell us a little bit about how you got your start and why you like doing the reining horses. Um, got my start in reining horses as a teenager, young kid. Um, my family's been involved in reining since the early 70s. And um, my brother passed away and 2001 came to the barn and just started riding rain horse as a non-pro and then uh, 2007 late 2007 mm -hmm. I uh, became a professional in the National Rain Horse Association and uh, just loved the sport and it's grown from there. Mm -hmm. So tell us a little bit about your program here like do you do lessons do you do only raining horses then you do jump what do you do? We do strictly raining horses um, I really don't do outside lessons I do lessons for my customers um, I have, you know, like 15 stalls of uh, reining horses, um, all owned by somebody besides myself. Um, we ride, train, prepare reining horses for competitions uh, in the NRHA. How often do you recommend your clients ride? They ride at least twice a week. Mm -hmm. Yeah, that's Sometimes. awesome. Yeah. So not all, not everybody does that. So it looks like you really want your clients to do well. Yeah, we've had a very successful non-pro program. Um, I think we won 22 year-end buckles for the local Northeast Reining Horse. Um, I'm a past NRHA world champion. My assistant, Samantha Silver, is a past NRHA world champion. Um, client that rides with me, Dennis Tito, he's a reserve world champion this year. Uh, actually, last year, 2011. Mm -hmm. So it's been a, it, it's, it works out well. So you're kind of a big deal. It works. It's pretty <laughs> fun. Yeah. So um, where do you see the horse industry going? Where do you think the economy has changed it, affected it, has it? Yes, it, oh, it definitely has. I mean, if you look at the breedings, I think they've fallen off, I think, uh, like 47% yeah. since uh, 2007. Um, they're breeding better horses for National Reining Horse. Um, yeah. We're not breeding as many. Mm -hmm. um, but, but I think it's coming back. We, we did hit a lull there and things were quiet. Um, we kept showing and nothing, I mean, really changed. The purses are still good. Mm -hmm. um, but it's headed back in, in a positive um, flow now. It, you see more horses and more riders coming back out. So uh, I'm positive where it's going to go. That's yeah. good. Hopefully it'll be a good year this yep. year. It looks it. Okay, yep. so this last one's a doozy. Okay, okay so if you mm -hmm. had one superhuman talent, what would it be? One superhuman You could have one. Talent. Tough ESP. ESP. If I knew how a horse show was going <laughs> to turn out, I would either go or I wouldn't. Nice. That's good to know. <laughs> yes, I would. That's right. Thanks for meeting us today. Thank you. Talk to you later. Bye-bye.